Russell, can you tell us how it all came about when you started working with Billy Joel? Liv and me and our bass player, Doug Stegmar, we were a band before Billy, and Doug was the first to leave. He got a call, and Billy, uh, he did a tour with Billy, I think on the West Coast or whatever. And at that point, Billy was going to move back. He wanted a band to do a new album. He wanted a New York band. Doug says, well, I know the drummer. He wanted a, a rhythm section, and Liberty just like fit right in. It was perfect. And then they went into the studio and started recording. He said, well, and now we need you know, some guitar players. And it was me and another guitar player named Howard Emerson. And we'd already been together for years, so we already had chemistry, and we already, uh, you know, it, it's not about the playing. It's about the playing plus the connection that we all had. We knew when to shut up, we knew when to play. We respected songs, so I mean, Billy just stepped in it when he got us. It was like, you know, so, and it came together. So we came in and did the guitar, so it was, it was like being with old friends, and you get this news that we heard these great songs and everything else, it just came together so easy. There was no producer when we did it. Uh, I mean, we, we really produced it ourselves. Wow. You know, so, so cool. you know, then, then when, uh, before the end of the album, they brought somebody in and they fixed it up. But frankly, I thought the basic track sounded better than the finished album because uh, you know there was some power there and you could you could hear it. This is the way we did it back then. Yeah. This was just we we were just a band living like a band. It's so different now. We we would hang out. We'd live together. We'd do it full time. You could afford to do it too. You could write thirty songs, throw them away, and start again. It was a band. Yep. That was the, that. That, that business model it seems to be gone. Yeah. People don't live in houses and hang out. And this was a daily thing. This was, this was the way it was. And that's partly why the music came out so great, right? Oh, yeah. I mean, it was the camaraderie you're talking about that I, you don't even look. You already are, you're already a football team going into the Super Bowl. Mm. It's, it's, that stuff doesn't happen anymore like, like this. It does, but not the way. This was the only way back then. Right.